So becoming a Postmate is really important. But how do you sign up? In this video, I'm gonna show you how to sign up for Postmates right after this. <laughs> What's up? My name is Young Lifestyle, aka Brandon, and welcome to another video. If this is your first time here and you want to build your entrepreneurial and ride share knowledge, be sure to hit that subscribe button and don't forget to hit that bell notification so you don't miss anything. Now you heard of Postmates and you want to get started. So without further ado, let's sign up. So the first thing that you want to do is you want to head over to your browser and you want to click Postmates Fleet. And at the very top, you'll see sign in Postmates fleet. So you're going to go ahead and press that. Now, this is usually where you'll sign in. But since you don't have an account yet, what you want to do is go to the top right and press sign up. So click that. It'll bring you to a screen right here with this overly happy guy. And you're going to want to choose an email that you're going to remember and type it in here. This is the email that you're going to use to sign into your account. So make sure it's something that you remember. So we're going to put in an email that I haven't used yet. Now what you want to do is you want to fill this out. So it's going to ask for your first last name, your mobile number, the city that you're going to work in and your vehicle type. So. I'm gonna go ahead and enter all that in so you guys don't see it. Also, my referral code, you wanna put in Brandon Young0824 at gmail.com. That's actually my email. The referral code is actually the email that you use to sign in, so don't forget that. Now the next thing they're gonna ask you for is your driver's license number and the expiration date and the state that you currently drive in. So you wanna go ahead and fill that out too. So I'm gonna go fill that out and then proceed to the next stage, which is your motor, ve motor vehicle insurance. Now, when I started doing Postmates, they actually didn't offer free welcome kits, but now they do. I'm not exactly sure what comes in the welcome kit. I think it's actually, you get the card and stuff like that, but you wanna just put in your address, the city, the state, zip code that you live, so they can send you your free welcome kit. So I'm gonna go ahead and fill that out and go to the next stage. Now, I'm not exactly sure what the state disclosure is, so you're gonna have to go ahead and read that, but I know disclosure and authorization is basically that you giving them permission to give you a background check and stuff like that. So you can go ahead and read that. And if you feel that everything is okay, which you should go ahead and just read through it and then press continue. So that's what we're going to do here. I'll just with any job that you get, usually they're going to ask you for a background check. So don't feel any type of way. Just go ahead, put your social security in your, um, your date of birth in there so they can give you a background check they just want to make sure they know who is working for them so go ahead and do that i'm gonna fill my stuff in and then proceed to the next stage now they offer you a whole list of exactly what you have to do so right here you have to verify your identity that's basically your background check so you gotta wait seven at least seven business days for that to process Usually from the people I know it processes in about three to four days, but expect to be waiting a long time. The next thing on there is to upload a selfie. So go ahead, make sure it's a good shot from the shoulders up, solid background. Make sure there's not a lot of other people in your background and you're not wearing sunglasses and stuff. You want it to be a nice, clear picture of you. And then you go ahead and upload that picture right here. So after you go and download your selfie, now you're going to go and watch that Postmates video right below it. So go ahead and go watch that. Go and try to activate that prepaid card, but you're not going to have the prepaid card yet because they actually haven't sent it out in the mail for you. So expect that to come in about three, I would say three to four days. So once that comes, you'll just come back into your, your um, sign-in 
and you'll just come back to this part and fill in all the information and you'll also fill out your banking information so after you do deliveries they can direct deposit you it's cool to know that they changed the whole onboarding session and stuff they actually made it really compact and put everything into the website so it's really easy for you guys to just do it in one shot last and final thing that you want to do if you haven't done it already is you want to go and download the fleet app so you're going to press that and then you're going to enter in your mobile number and get the link if you want to build your ride share and entrepreneurial knowledge be sure to go and hit that subscribe button for me i do make these videos very constantly so go hit that subscribe button for me until next time guys it's your boy young lifestyle signing out peace